In several parts of the country, snow, ice and rain are complicating holiday travels. Marley Hall has more on that. This isn't the type of white Christmas many travelers had hoped for. All this snow in Wisconsin caused a plane carrying the Minnesota Vikings to slide off a runway last night. No one was hurt. It was snowing, really big flakes, the roads were terrible. People across the Northwest and Midwest are bracing for more travel headaches. Heavy snow and freezing rain are expected to slow down some of the estimated 103 million Americans taking to the airways, rails and roads this holiday season. We are projecting that the busiest times to travel are going to be the first few days before the holiday season and those first few days after. And so Tamara Johnson of AAA says about 94 million people will be taking advantage of lower gas prices on their holiday road trips. So we encourage drivers whenever they leave, try to leave early in the morning and if at all possible, try to avoid driving through major cities during peak travel times. Try to travel on the holiday if you can. Bad weather was to blame for more than 620 U.S. flight cancellations on Friday, according to flight tracking website flightaware.com. On the West Coast, heavy rain and wind toppled this tree in Burbank and snarled air traffic, causing long lines and flight delays at LAX. I'll miss my connecting flight, so we'll see when I get home. But for many, all the travel troubles couldn't dampen their holiday cheer. We are going to Animal Kingdom down in uh, Disney World. To California. <laughs> Here at LaGuardia Airport, lines are moving along. And that's the case at the majority of airports across the country. DeMarco, as of this afternoon, there have been less than 100 U.S. flight cancellations. Marley Hall, thank you.